Hey guys, what is up? It's Dusty here, back with another crypto video, and today we're going to be talking about Ripple and XRP. We got some pretty cool topics, some pretty interesting articles here. It's definitely going to be an action-packed video. So guys, we're also giving away $200 worth of XRP, and all that you have to do to enter this giveaway is press the like button on this video, comment something down below, and make sure you have the notification bell on. That is it to start off here sbi group backed mobile cryptocurrency wallet brd adopts xrp all of this stuff is pretty cool and pretty amazing on its own like i have a couple of articles open here and i think every one of them i could make into a whole separate video as there's just so much to talk about and so many reasons why i think it is all amazing but before we really get into any of that i do want to show you guys just briefly my second channel it is called dusty finance make sure you just go ahead and check it out and watch a couple of videos on here if you're into finance or into investing or anything like that because i do think it is worth your time and i definitely have a couple of you know, cool tips on there there's no advertisements in these videos they're completely free to watch no tricks no nothing so make sure you just go ahead and check them out. Ripple Labs Inc. has vowed to spring up the development of its on-demand liquidity product that uses XRP for cross-border payments, and it is doing so. First was the announcement of Logo's acquisition, Algrim and BitPay followed, and here comes the update of a Switzerland-based cryptocurrency wallet company, BRD, which adopted Ripple's XRP lately. In line with a declaration made by a leading officer at Ripple's Spring, Ethan Beard, BRD, a crypto trading company that SBI Group invested millions of dollars in, is now part of the XRP community. Beard said, Welcome to the party, BRDHQ. Great to have you here. And while acknowledging the statement, BRD stated that it is happy to be part of the XRP community. They stated officially on Twitter, BRD is excited to officially be part of the XP community, as announced today by Ethan Beard. Great event, packed house, thanks for including us at Ripple. Again, it was a little bit ago already, two days, but it was a pretty interesting event, pretty interesting um, what Ripple announced over there, and you can, you can see our guy right there. Pretty amazing, all this stuff. Further, BRD said it will soon add XRP token suits platform. It said right here, we're also looking forward to bringing XRP to BRD community. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, why is this linked? Well, SBI, in January 2019, their holdings subsidiary company, SBI Crypto Investment, invested $15 million in BRD in a Series B funding. BRD said it's happy to be SBI's business partner, and the firm at the time pledged to use the Series B fund to expand its reach in Japan and across Asia. As we write, BRD boasts of customers in over 170 countries and 2 plus million Android and iOS apps installed. I actually did not know they had such a huge span on this world. I didn't even know BRD was actually this big. Now it's funny, his logo looks a little bit like mine. If we go back to my channel, I don't know how we can get there. Uh, just one step back. You can see, you know, it, it has some... It looks a little bit like it. You can, you can see the resemblance. Pretty funny. But yeah, Ripple invades Nordic Island Nation. We already know about that. That is actually part of Agrim Crypto trading platform, the Agrim Crypto platform. Because recently, Ripple shifted its tentacles into the Nordic Island Nation, Iceland, with its acquisition of that one over there. We already knew about it. And Ripple joins hands with the world's largest blockchain payment provider. This is, again, as we said before, with BitPay. Also pretty amazing, pretty cool, but... I think all this is already quite clear to all y'all, so I don't think I need to go into very much detail to explain what it is all about. If you're watching this far, guys, make sure you press the like button on this video. And also, if we forgot to mention at the beginning of the video, if we hit 299 likes, it is normally. But I think for this video, I think it's a pretty interesting subject. Let's put the amount of likes at 350. I know you guys can do that. I know. You can just press the like button right now and maybe... Another time, you just press it again to make sure it is extra liked, unless that takes the like away. I don't really know what it does. To make sure you, you know, show some support, and also so we hit that amount of likes so we give the money away. Technical formation signals that XRP could soon go on a meteoric bull run. I don't like to cover these articles, guys. From the bottom of my heart, I really do not like to cover them so much. It actually allows so much hate to pop up in the space and it really does more harm than it does good whenever i cover this type of stuff as well and the sad part about it is i know all right but it's what people want 
it's what I find out there very often. It's also something that must be talked about and must be discussed, as you might have guessed it as well. People like to know this type of stuff. You know, when 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 one goes to to rant about a meteoric bull run, people want to know what the ins and outs are. People want to know where it came from. People want to know more, 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 more. And so if I find an article that explains or at least tells us that X amount of gains are coming or, you know, um, a run is going to be coming up or it's a bull run, this, that, this, that, you know, anything related to some major gains coming up, I want to take a look, right? And I'm assuming that since I want to take a look, a lot of you guys are also interested in, in you know, kind of checking into what they're saying and why they're saying that these gains might be coming. Again, I might be completely off. Maybe I'm completely stupid thinking that you guys like to see this type of stuff. But if I were you, I would be quite interested in what somebody had to say about these crazy price increases. How is that though? Let's take a look. So the beginning here is about a little bit about Bitcoin, a little bit about Ethereum. One prominent analyst who had previously noted that XRP was at risk of falling significantly lower in the near term is now noting that the crypto is showing some signs of having established a long-term bottom against its Bitcoin trading pair and parabolic gains could be imminent. And when I read that, I already know exactly who the person they, want to be, they were going to be quoting was and exactly what they were going to be stating. I mean, if you guys have been living under a rock for the last couple of days, you probably don't know, but the rest of the people in the crypto space most likely know it is about Peter Brandt. All right, my computer needs to be restarted. I'm seeing. Mm -mm -mm. Let's press later. I don't know what's going to be happening to it. I, I think we could just keep recording, right? If I press later on computer update, I think so. Um, but yeah, Crypto Brand or Peter Brand actually is kind of known to be not that much of a, a XRP lover. But in the end here, he's been pretty positive with the coin. And a lot of people are taking it, even I personally, we're taking it as sarcasm at first because, I mean, why would he change his perspective all of a sudden? But when looking at XRP to BTC, it did actually and was actually looking pretty damn positive. So it's again kind of difficult to see exactly if he was joking or not, because what he is saying at this point does seem quite right. You can see also the amount of likes. Galaxy BTC and some other analysts, even I personally, have kind of looked at the, the charts and kind of predicted and, and come to a conclusion that, yes, it's a pretty high likely. The chance is definitely there. But in the end... Who knows, right? I mean, who is going to know if it's going to change over or if it's going to stay doing exactly the same thing? Nobody really knows. It's just what looks most likely to occur. And in this case, it looked like XRP to BTC at bottom out. But then, right after that, if you're opening TradingView right now, and if you're looking at it um, you know, whilst, whilst you're watching this video, if you're watching it today when I upload it, you most likely have also seen that, yeah, the price is not doing too good. And XRP to BTC was actually going on a decline at least as I have just checked it below uh, before making this video. It was on a decline. I'm assuming that the chances <laughs> are, are quite high that it is still on the decline right this second. But you don't know. Maybe it's not. Maybe I was um, you know, just just seeing it at an unlucky time. But yeah, that, that would mean that we might have not bottomed out. Might go lower than that. So in the end, you know, you, you always have the same situation where you don't really know what the end is going to be. Just wanted to quickly mention this part as well. It's about Binance adding new XRP trading pairs and wrapped XRP tokens on its chain. There were a lot of questions uh, concerning this and people asking, you know, why is this needed? Why is it bad? This, that, this, that. Well, they're actually just giving XRP a little bit of special treatment. And this is actually only positive for them. I do not see this in any negative way at all. Binance chain will be releasing wrapped XRP tokens and putting them on the BAP2 uh, chain. Changping Zhao, the CEO of Binance, also confirmed that this is a necessary step towards eventually adding more XRP-based trading pairs. And also, we're working with some decentralized stuff here, guys. You cannot just do it the, the traditional fashion all the time. They probably had no other option. I think it's a very good initiative, though. It's a pretty cool idea. Coinbase may acquire Ripple-backed platform that utilizes XRP. Report. Coinbase is reportedly interested in acquiring the Ripple-backed startup Omni. I know we, we heard a little bit about Omni before. I actually, actually don't exactly remember, though, what it was about between Ripple and Omni, what they're, what they're doing right now, or even what Omni uh, was about back in that day. But now Omni allows neighbors to find and rent items from one another, from bikes to sleeping bags by searching specific keywords or categories, i.e. home, traveling, game nights, seasonal holiday, all that type of stuff. And the service, which delivers items locally, also allows users to earn money whenever their items are rented. 
Users can cash out their earnings to an XRP wallet, making it one of the first platforms that allows people to acquire XRP outside of an exchange. Pretty interesting initiative. Pretty damn cool, it sounds like. A lot of loopholes, a lot of hurt, but also a pretty cool idea. The San Francisco-based company has struggled to gain users and is now in the early stage acquire talks with both Coinbase and Thumbtack, according to a report from TechCrunch. And the deal would give Coinbase the opportunity to utilize members of Omnize's engineering team, which is most likely what they're doing these acquisitions for, like Ripa has been doing the last couple of weeks here, um, acquiring a lot of new engineers for themselves by buying a lot of companies or at least investing into them to, to grab those engineers. They would work on Coinbase Earn, a Coinbase platform that allows customers around the world to earn digital currency or cryptocurrency while learning about blockchain tech and the digital asset ecosystem. CEO and co-founder at Omni, Thomas McLeod, says Omni's mission is to connect the world through things as they work to build out an entire rental marketplace. By enabling XRP cash outs, we're aiming to lower the barrier to entry for crypto curious consumers and also reduce the risk because you still own the asset. So there's a world in which everything that you have should be able to connect with other people and other people should be able to use those things as well. So if you have a bike and you're not using it, someone else can use it when you're not using it. And now you can also make money on top of that. Well, one thing I should always ask is like, what if it gets stolen, right? Do you like have to um, put a, a certain fee in it at the start or what? How does that work? Because for example, do you have to put in the amount that you want to get cashed out if your item gets stolen or broken? Uh up front so like for example you want to rent your bike for 10 bucks a day and like your fee is 400 bucks if it gets stolen does somebody like have to agree to that before he's able to rent it or or how does it work you know can somebody just rent it real quick or can you only do your neighbors the people that you already know because then you don't have to use the platform for it right you could just go to your neighbor and ask him so that's pretty interesting but yeah, today omna has raised more than 40 million dollars in venture capital and through various partnerships Ripple invested $25 million in the company through spring uh, one and a half year ago. And Omni's rental service is currently available in S Francisco, uh, San Francisco Bay Area, New York City, Los Angeles, and Portland. All right. Price analysis for a lot of these coins. Well, I'm not too excited about the price action. I'm also not too much in the mood to be covering all of it. It's pretty much the same as we saw before. Not too much has changed in, in the last day since we, we covered a lot of these coins. Chain analysis at support for 10 ERC-20 tokens, XRP and Doge coming soon. Chain analysis has added support for 10 ERC-20 tokens, including Maker, DAI, and BAT. Firm intends to add coverage for XRP, Doge, and more in the coming months. It's also pretty interesting. And, yeah, I mean, chain analysis is not that popular, not that crazy. But, you know, some integrations coming soon, some more, more stuff coming on there. <laughs> um... That's basically what I wanted to tell you guys about this one. It's, it's not too significant. And last but not least, XRP inches closer towards a 90% upside profit zone with every passing day. XRP recorded one of the most astounding breakouts during the 2017 bull run. It exploded from a mere 22 cents to $3.30, i.e. a 1400% increase in a matter of 20 odd days. Since then, XRP's fanatics have been longing for a pump similar to the aforementioned run, as their bags are getting heavier despite the fact that the price remains stagnant. On a shorter term here, the short term chart for XRP shows that the price is stuck in a parallel channel with higher highs and higher lows. The channel is fresh, which means that price will move in the channel a little longer before breaking out of it. The 50 and 100 moving average have expanded to hold the price between them, and the price was recently supported by the 50 moving average and the lower part of the channel. However, it is yet to rise to the top of the channel where it will face resistance from the 100 moving average. RSI indicates a similarity with price, however the MACD suggests sideways or neutral movement. Now for longer term, Irrespective of what's happening on the short-term chart, the long-term prospects for XRP look quite bullish, which is actually interesting for them to say. The XRP chart indicates the formation of a combination of falling wedge fractals that were last seen just before the 2017 bull run. Pre-2017 bull run, the price underwent two massive falling wedges, 
and following the price moving sideways for a while, XRP saw a humongous spike of 1400%. As of now, the price has undergone three such falling wedges fractals, and the price has hit lows last seen before the bull run. So assuming something similar happens, the upside for XRP looks quite bullish. If the price shoots up in a similar fashion, it might not be long before we see XP breach $3 and beyond. This was it for the video, guys. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Make sure you press the like button on this video right now. Make sure you join the Facebook group in the description below. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, the Dusty BC. Make sure you follow me on the YouTubes and my second channel. And also, guys, make sure you see me next video. There's going to be a lot of videos coming up tomorrow, so make sure you just refresh on the channel, guys. A lot of cool content, a lot of news is going to be posted on here. So see you guys again in another crypto video soon.